back, well, Courtney Stubbs and Jack Miller were elated when they discovered they were pregnant, but the reality TV couple's story was far from traditional, with Courtney opening up about her struggles with adjustment disorder. Courtney, Jack and baby Penelope, who's three days old, yeah. join us yeah. now. And you were just sitting down, Courtney, because she just had a bit of a grizzle then. She's gone back yes. to Oh, you know, you, look at those so thumb taps. She's three had. days old, I mean... You've really gone back to work early. Uh, <laughs> <laughs> straight onto it. Tell us how you guys are feeling great about this. I feel amazing. I actually feel like I'm a different person. Yeah. I feel, without getting too woo, like I feel I've been reborn. The air tastes sweeter. <laughs> I'm so happy. She's so perfect. Yeah. I finally understand when parents look at their kid and go, oh, she's perfect. And you know, you're like, mm, really? Like, yeah. it has to be your own kid. <laughs> and I look at her and I'm like, oh my God, I'm one of those parents now. Yeah. It is a profound shift, isn't it? It's it a, is. It's really an amazing thing. You've had a great birth and yes. obviously everything is going well on yes. the other side, mm -hmm. but your pregnancy wasn't all that easy, was it? No. And it's Perinatal Mental Health Week. Why did you want to open up about that? I feel like there's just not enough conversation about how hard pregnancy can be. Mm. It's really glamorised and everyone makes it seem like it's so perfect. And it's actually really, really hard. And it's a really long time. Everyone <laughs> goes, oh, it goes so quick. And once she comes out, like you forget it all. I'm three days after birth, I've not forgot anything. Yeah. <laughs> I'm still traumatized. Yeah. But I just wanted to be honest because when I was struggling, I thought I'm the only one struggling. No one else is. Like, why has this happened to me? Why am I the only one that's had such a hard pregnancy? And then as soon as I opened up about it, everyone goes, no, nope, me too. Yeah, yeah. It is hard. No, my, mine hasn't been perfect. Mine's been just as hard, if not harder. Like, even... A lot of gratitude it, as well. A lot well. of gratitude because mm. I realised even as hard as mine was, people do have it harder and it just gets trickier. Mm. Well, Jack, how does that feel for you watching Courtney go through all of this? It's one of the hardest things. I think a really common male trait is the fix-it attitude mm. you know it's he's always, such a like bob the builder yeah like, you know it's just, i just I, I want to be able to fix it and unfortunately when it comes to pregnancy quite literally it's all her body doing all the work and you're on the sidelines yeah and as much as i can do things like clean the dishes i can help with it do all of the housework and all of the cooking and all that kind of stuff it gets really difficult um when you still see your partner struggling and that was probably the hardest thing to mentally grasp at the time. It is really hard yeah. for partners when someone's going through something like that. Have, have other women been reaching out to you about their experiences and what have they said to you? I've had some really beautiful stories shared with me. It's really interesting how strangers can open up to someone they don't even know. Like I would get paragraphs and paragraphs being like, this is exactly how my pregnancy went. This is what I've struggled with. But once baby was born, everything was worth it, which was always like the best kick at the end mm. of all the stories. But I was just so surprised how comfortable people felt to open up to me to a complete stranger they didn't even know. And that it's was so like special. They permission. Yeah. Like you gave them permission to be, by talking, yeah. you gave mm. all the other women out there that have struggled permission to so go. It was so special. Like I felt so grateful that they wanted to tell me these stories to try and make me feel better. And they don't owe me anything. Like, why are they trying to make me feel better? A total stranger. Like, it's Well, you've made us feel better incredible. by Brie and Penelope. And <laughs> <It's> adorable. <laughs> she, she may have had a little bit of a grizzle before we got on air, but once we get on air, she's like, camera's on, I'm off. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> what Straight a pro. It's all the bum taps. What a pro. Yeah. Yeah. We've already got motherhood nailed. Well done. <laughs> well done, <laughs> you too. You should see it's how easy. quick she flicked Come over. On, give it a go. <laughs> <laughs> no dramas. Guys, congratulations. Congrats. Thank Lovely you to meet so, Penelope so much. Too. Love to see you. Enjoy it all. When Cheers. we return, we'll